Here's my uh, one foot wide by ten foot long by half foot thick piece of cut foam and I've laid my stringer on one edge and I'm going to use it as a template uh, and a pen to trace out the uh, outline of the uh, stringer. Okay, so there's the outline drawn onto the edge of the block. I'm going to do the same thing on uh, the edge of the uh, second piece of foam. And of course I'm going to line up the uh, stringer with respect to the edge the same way on both edges. I've applied uh, a bead of glue to one side of the stringer. I'm using a white fast curing Gorilla Glue. Um, I'm taking care to put the glue well inside the perimeter of the stringer because the glue expands enormously and uh, I don't want it rising to the top of the foam because then it, I have to shape through the glue and that's not easy to do. So now I'm just going to flip the uh, stringer over, uh, align it onto the blank edge and then just uh, put some cans of paint every few feet along the stringer just to hold it down against the stringer. Then I'm going to let it dry uh, for at least a few hours. So uh, there's my stringer held down against the uh, EPS blank. I'm going to let it dry for a few hours. So I put some uh, Gorilla Glue on the other face of the stringer and then position the uh, other one foot wide EPS block on top. Uh, of course squared up the two blocks and put a bunch of weight on top to let it dry overnight. Yeah. 